All right, got you your Mountain TV forecast. I'm going to start watching for some chances of snow soon. First for southern Colorado, and yeah, all of our mountains need some. We're still running below average for snowpack, so we could use some snow. It is still looks uh, to be a potentially more active forecast in the days ahead. Checking in this morning at Winter Park. Yeah, cleaning up for uh, another day, fun day on the slopes. It was a beautiful sunny day yesterday in Copper Mountain, and clear skies tonight. Will be mostly sunny to start the day. A lot of morning lows, single digits above and below zero. Be mindful with this cold start to the day. There might be some areas of basin fog and maybe some freezing fog. In southern Colorado, Purple Shade, our first winter weather advisories are out there. Uh, for southeast Colorado, the wet mountains, some areas below 7,500 feet, 11 a.m. tomorrow to 11 p.m. tomorrow, so Thursday, 2 to 5 inches of snow there. For southwest Colorado, 11 p.m. today to 11 p.m. tomorrow for the winter weather advisory. Probably around two to five inches of snow includes spots like Pagosa Springs to Cortez. Southwest San Luis Mountains, five to ten inches of snow in the forecast for you in the winter weather advisory. But potentially in the San Juan, Sangre de Cristos, southern Sangre de Cristos, could get a foot of snow or over a foot of snow for the next couple of days. And then snow numbers really drop the farther north we go. Tomorrow, maybe a trace in the Denver metro. Aspen Vale, Crested Butte Steamboat, somewhere between a coating to a couple inches. Some of our central mountains may see a few inches of snow out of this today and tomorrow or tonight and tomorrow northern colorado way northern colorado might whiff and see nothing completely now highs today we are above average before the cool down arrives again eventually this week uh late this week in the weekend we're still like a handful to two handfuls of degrees above average winds are still generally light might pick up a tad in areas of southwest colorado 23 and cortez tonight so we'll have increasing clouds work east of the continental divide we're still dry today Slight chance of snow, southwest Colorado this afternoon, but after sunset, this is when we start to get active. Some snow, maybe some wintry mixes to start as well, will favor southern Colorado. So if you're driving south, be mindful of wintry driving conditions for the next couple of days, and snow numbers will really drop and get lower the farther north, north of I-70 we go. Again, Denver, I'll mention a chance of a trace tomorrow, a slippery trace, that's about it, 38 for our high tomorrow. Maybe slight chances for the weekend at best. Steamboat Springs and Rocky Mountain National Park, Eldora, Winter Park, dry today. Highs vary in the 20s and 30s. Chance of light snow tomorrow. But Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, there will be some more chances of light to moderate snow passing through. Vail likely dry. Aspen likely dry. 37, 38. Chance of light snow tomorrow. But more chances with cooler temperatures finally moving in for the weekend. Around Summit County, dry today. 25 in Loveland Ski. 35 down in Breckenridge. Chance of maybe an inch or so of snow tomorrow. And then more chances Saturday and Sunday. Southwest Colorado, be mindful of winter weather advisories. We'll have some potentially heavy snow at times tonight and tomorrow. Mountain traffic time.